I can't believe time is where it is, like seriously. So Monday morning when I realized that we were down to single digits, I had to have a come to Jesus moment with myself. Um, more because many times I support my friends telling them that they can do whatever their goals are, whether it is training for a 5K, running a half marathon, um, going to get a new job and not sure if they should leave, or this, competing. Am I ready to get on the stage? And I'm a firm believer that if you don't allow your mind to believe that you're going to achieve something, then your body won't follow. Again, it's regardless if you're out there training to run a 5K or you're training to become the leanest version of yourself push yourself through workouts so that you can step on stage for a few minutes. And that's where I've been probably for the last couple months is not really believing when my coach said she had a specific show she wanted me to kick this season off with, a national show. Me, national show? I'm still in disbelief, but I'm moving forward because if I don't let myself believe that I can do it, then my body won't ever get there. Two years ago, I guess, was the first time that I really liked what I saw post-show. <laughs> During the show, I didn't see it. The show was um, in Myrtle Beach. I loved the way that I looked. I loved my makeup. Of course, during that moment, I was a little shaky about it, but when it was all over, I was like, holy heavens, I want that. I want that. Um, last year was a little rough, the first two shows because of things going on, but the last show of 2018 when I went to Atlanta, I loved the way I looked. I loved um, everything that I gave those last few weeks to get on stage, so I want that also. The combination of my 2017 last show and the 2018 last show wrapped up together for this entire season. I know I can do it. So from the next few weeks, it's all out. I will share the ins and outs. And sometimes it's going to be short little videos because it's a reminder, a uh, view into my world about what's happening and what it's going to take to get me on that stage very soon i mean like very soon so here we are working on the belief the confidence with the support of a few people um and showing you the ins and outs of it all um the good the bad and what i consider the ugly because there'll be a lot of ugly between now and show day i can say uh, i will say one of the things that I did last night, because my fitness partner in crime slash pavement sister slash teammate asked me about booking hotel rooms and I hadn't done it, I did that last night. I booked two rooms, but I'm going to look for an Airbnb because I'm unsure of how many people are coming. Um, and it's probably more cost effective to get an Airbnb versus two hotel rooms from what I looked at last night. But one thing is checked off. I've booked two hotel rooms as of the recording of this video. I'm also going to make uh, my hair appointment. Um, that's next. And I don't know what else is next for today. But every day is going to be something. So happy single digits weeks out, I'll say we're eight weeks out. By the time I post this, I will actually have done the show eight weeks from the posting of this. I can't believe it, but we're gonna do this. You, me, and my tribe will get me on stage in eight weeks, beating the combinations of two looks and two feelings that I had 
2017, 2018 to produce a awesome 2019 season. Are you ready? I'm not sure I am, but we're gonna give it everything we've got. Till the next video. See you then.